I am now officially 11 days out. It's my current physique update. Veins are coming in really well. Skin's feeling really tight. All in all, I think we're doing all right. As you can see, it's even further down now. It's a weird feeling. Not used to this. But anyway, um, had a little bit of carbs the last couple days, and now I'm going to taper them off really harshly for the next few days, deplete really hard, and then recarb back up. I'm gonna see if I can get my uh, body fat down any any lower, get rid of any you know water held onto by the carbs. So that being said, lower carb today. I'm gonna take you through my day of eating. So here we go. All right guys, so I got my first meal here. It's kind of my smaller meal. I got about seven ounces of egg whites. I threw some um, like sauteed peppers and onions that I made the other day on there. And uh, we got hot sauce and then a little bit of reduced sugar ketchup for some taste. There's like five or 10 calories in there. Not really too worried about it. Um, I removed my carb from this meal because um, I actually had higher carbs yesterday. So I'm going to track and see how I am tomorrow morning and then I might do the same thing for my meal in the morning depending on where my weight's at, how I'm looking and whatnot. So until my next meal. All right guys, time for my next meal. All right, so my next meal here we're looking at four ounces of ground chicken, 100 grams of asparagus, and that is four ounces of mashed cauliflower, and a couple squ squirts of uh, spray butter. So again, pretty low carb, and it's about to be delicious, so I can't wait. I'm starving. What's up, guys? So we made it back home. Looking at my next meal, we have about 100 grams of asparagus. This here is one cup of uh, spiraled carrots. So you use it like noodles. And then I got five ounces of chicken. And then what I did is I took some Walden Farms zero calorie um, pasta sauce, put it on there. Super good. I think I might do some kind of review of all this Walden Farms here shortly. But anyway, about to enjoy this. I'm starving again. What's up guys, it is time for my pre-workout meal. This is pretty much the only meal today that I'm having like actual starchy carbs other than, you know, just your regular vegetables. So I only have four ounces of ground chicken. Um, I really like the ground chicken. It has a decent amount of flavor. It has a tiny bit more fat than the, than the lean ground turkey I've been using, but it has way more flavor. So I've been really liking that. 100 grams of asparagus. And then I got four ounces of sweet potatoes, and then I put, just put some cinnamon on top, so that's why it looks like that, as well as a little bit of spray butter. So still not a lot of food, but should be pretty satisfying because we're going to go train here soon. Hopefully these carbs will give me some energy. All right, what's up, guys? It's time for my last meal today. I'm going to make some protein ice cream. So we're going to start off with some egg whites. So we're going to do four ounces. Next up, we're gonna do protein. I'm gonna use the uh, Fudge Brownie ISO 100 Dimatize. This one is really good. All right, next up, I'm gonna use two tablespoons of this Nuts and More cookie butter. It's high protein, uh, like peanut butter type stuff. This one tastes pretty darn good. Actually, scratch that. I'm gonna use this Nuts and More Chocolate almond, I'm gonna use two tablespoons of this instead.
All right, next up, kind of my secret ingredients for these shakes, or ice cream, whatever, is these Walden Farms Marshmallow Dip, calorie free. I put about two decent sized tablespoons of that, and then I just put some of this Walden Farms chocolate syrup in, just kind of to taste, so. And then last thing, we're gonna do two tablespoons of PB2, the chocolate peanut butter one. really good so now what I'm gonna do you can go ahead and put it in a bowl throw it in the freezer for about 20 minutes or so and it's gonna be some ice cream so I just made it out of the shower ice cream's been chilling in the freezer for probably about 20 30 minutes now if that I had some extra carbs to play with so I have some of this like organic peanut butter is it cocoa choco how do you say it? <laughs> Coco dots. Oh, yeah, Choco dots. Yeah, so I did like half a cup, so it's really only like, I don't know, 10, 12 grams of carbs, if that. So not really that much, but let's see what it looks like. So I kind of sprinkled them throughout there as it chilled, but that looks like it's going to be pretty good. Let's give it a try real quick. As you can see, the texture got a nice little frozen top and then the insides a little bit more soupy you could say it's excellent very chocolate and peanut buttery so I'm a fan anyway that's my full day of eating like I said that's a very low lower carb day only gonna run this for probably a couple more days hopefully soon we can uh, we can carb up but uh we're getting there Feeling pretty good, feeling pretty confident. So I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.